This pizzeria, this is my son's favorite place to go, is special for Leah Pierce and her family. But now, they're visiting it with a hole in their hearts. He was my sunshine because he was my only son. Nine year old Jamel Miles started fourth grade at Joe Shoemaker School on Monday. Weeks before, he had the courage to tell his mom this. He looked so scared when he told me. He was like, Mom, I'm gay. And I thought he was playing, and I looked back at him because I was driving, and he was just curled up like this. So scared, and I just looked at him, I was like, I still love you. He went to school, and he said he was going to tell people he's gay because he's proud of himself. But on Thursday, heartbreak. Pierce found her son dead in their Denver home. She says he killed himself after being bullied. Four days is all it took at school. I could just imagine what they said to him. My son told my oldest daughter, the kids at school told him to kill himself. I'm just sad he didn't come to me. A letter from Denver Public Schools to Families Friday says they're providing extra social workers and their crisis team for students. In a statement, the district says it'll continue to offer support to the family. I'm more so upset that he thought that was his option. Through this devastation, Pierce wants to spread awareness about the effects of bullying. I should have accountability for bullying. I think the child should because the child knows it's wrong because the child wouldn't want them to do someone to do it to them. I think the parents should be held because obviously the parents are either teaching them to be like that or the parents are treating them like that. Hoping no parent ever has to go through this pain Jamel, because their child is different from everyone else.